from WFSB. This is an Eyewitness News update. I'm Aaliyah Red. Here are some of the stories we are following. First, we are working to learn more about a potential explosive device that was discovered in a busy area of Meriden Friday morning. This is right on Hanover Street. In addition to detectives and bomb squad, investigators used a police robot that is often spotted in situations like this. It is unclear what was detonated, and police tell us this remains an active investigation. And happening tomorrow, downtown Hartford will be filled with UConn fans as the city celebrates the national champs. Thousands of people are expected in the capital city for a victory parade, and fans are looking forward to seeing the players, the coaches, and hearing from the first back-to-back -back national champions since 2007. Here's a look at the route. It kicks off at 11 a.m. at the corner of Trinity Street and Elm Street. All right, for the rest of our Friday, outside of one more round of uh, showers, perhaps some downpours, some improvement, the worst of the wind behind us, and with partial clearing temperatures will be in the 60 to 65 degree range. Cooler, mostly cloudy for our Saturday. Some isolated showers are possible, not a washout. Temps in the 50s at times will feel more like the 40s. Sunday, we start dry and bright, 60 to 65 during the afternoon. Some late day showers, maybe a rumble of thunder. Next week, brighter and trending much warmer, especially through the middle part of the week with renewed chances for rain Wednesday, Thursday.